While some people in Central Arkansas are enjoying the 4th of July holiday, building memories, others are trying to rebuild their homes and their lives. The March 31st tornado left a stain on the lives of many Arkansans, and when holidays roll around, that stain seems to sink in deeper. That's right. I spoke with a woman whose life was disrupted 13 weeks ago when she's trying to smile through her tears. But today is a bittersweet holiday, along with the others that have come and gone since the March 31st tornado. If it was a year ago today, this neighborhood would be lined with flags. On this 2023 4th of July holiday, Briar Creek and surrounding areas are lined with rubble and trash produced by the horrendous March 31st tornado. Barbecuing, kids playing, swimming. Susan Kinney has lived in this home for 30 years. Since the tornado, Easter, Memorial Day, Father's Day, and more holidays have passed, and they just aren't the same. I come from a, a large family, and we're together every holiday. And it's not just one or two, it's the whole family. And that's how the families are around here. And it's, we don't have that now. Thinking back on the last day of March, tears began to stream down Kenny's face. She says she was inside Kroger in the Colony West Shopping Center when the twister hit. It took her four hours to make it home. My husband took me inside and uh, and it started to hit where he did hit and what was gone. This whole part of the porch right here was caved in to the garage. It went in just like this. Many repairs have been made to her home, but the surrounding damage remains thick, keeping nightmares fresh no matter the time of day. Every Wednesday when the sirens go off, I panic. But one day at a time, she knows the light will shine brighter and brighter and memories made from the holidays to come will wipe away the ones with dark clouds. God bless America and God bless us. And please keep us in your thoughts and prayers.